Well, this feels weird to even look at myself in a camera like this. It's been a long time um, since I have done this. Um, I don't even really know where to start. Um, for those of you who do not follow us on Instagram, um, you probably are wondering what the heck happened. Um, we have been gone from YouTube for a little over a year now for a number of different reasons. Um, I, or we both always said that, um, we love YouTube, but sometimes certain things that you go through are hard to share and have kind of like the public watching it. And um, life just got a little too crazy for us. And the idea of publicly navigating those feelings is not something that we were prepared for. And so in kind of a quick fashion and decision, we, uh, made everything private and kind of shut everything down. Fully anticipating that we would never come back when we made our YouTube page private and kind of like shut everything down, like I said, things were really, really dark and really, really bad for us. And we, at that point, did not think that we were ever going to be parents or that we would ever have a reason to come back. Thankfully, life changed a lot from that point. Um, a lot of crazy things happened, and uh, I can say 100% looking back at how we felt a year ago, this is never a place that I thought that we would be in. 2018 has been a year of healing and redemption and a lot of changes and a lot of really cool things. 2018 has been a year of making a lot of wrongs right and making a lot of big steps in our life that we didn't anticipate. So with that said, we have decided to dip our toes back into the water, so to speak, with YouTube and Instagram as well, which we kind of have been updating uh, people there for a while. And so if you have been following us there, then you know kind of what has been happening. We went through a lot of crappy stuff last year and a lot of stuff that we were not prepared to share then and we're not prepared to share now. With us coming back, it is very much a, to put it bluntly, moving from this day forward in our lives and not going back to rehash things that happened or to explain things that happened. Um, we very much just want to kind of document um, life with our daughter now and whatever kind of comes in the future from this point on. So I know a lot of people are gonna have a lot of questions. A lot of people are like, what the heck happened? What, you know, what happened in these certain circumstances? A lot of people have been speculating for a long time. A lot of people made up just blatant lies and untrue things. Um, and that was a big decision in our, that was a big part of our decision to take a step back and to kind of shut everything down. Because in that place of hurt, we were not prepared to sit down and be like, well, no, this didn't happen, this did happen. Because lies are hurtful. And a lot of times in these situations, if you guys have been following us for a long time, you know that we can't say a lot about different things and so it's kind of hard to defend yourself when you can't really say anything other than it's not true. So at this point, I am really hoping that people are ready to kind of move forward with us and enjoy just this life with this little girl that we love so very much. I will say, and it will become apparent in our videos, um, if you are not familiar with what happened, we no longer have Charlotte and we actually have adopted now officially a little girl. Her name is Eloise. We were matched with her um, at the end of November of last year and she was born in May of this year. So she actually today turned seven months old. Um, we finalized her adoption in September, so it's been a little while now. And kind of along the way of realizing when we shut everything down, we weren't anticipating ever adopting, period, or having children. And so it kind of was definitely 
meant to be for us to be in this situation and as things kept kind of unraveling and falling into place we kind of started thinking about okay well maybe we would like to document things again um, you know it does make me sad a little bit to think about the last year of things happening that we don't really have documented I think we have some footage of stuff and obviously I have pictures and videos on my phone that we can hopefully share um, I'm sure we'll do kind of like stories to fill you guys in on how everything happened we want to have these memories for ourselves and I hope that over the next year or two that we will be growing our family again at least once and so I want I don't want to miss out on those moments for next time I am making this video to kind of say we're back in a way um, I would like my one 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 request and one thing that I has kept us from posting is just worrying that people are going to have a lot of unfair questions for us and not really be ready to move forward I'm hoping after this long of a time and you guys seeing how happy we are with our little girl that everybody's kind of willing to let the past go in the past and move forward. Our lives are full of joy and happiness now and this little girl has brought so much love and promise and peace to our lives that we're not willing to jeopardize that to be on YouTube again. I hope that you guys are ready to love our little girl with us and to embrace us and love us again and if not that's fine too i want to tell i don't want to say the end of our story because i don't think it's over but i know i want for people who followed us along and who you know we gave hope to to see at least the end of this journey of bringing our first baby home and to see that you can go through a lot a lot of just bad crappy stuff and you can still have a beautiful happy ending because that is 100 percent what we have so i'm really excited to and derek is too he's just at work that's a new change is that he goes to work now i mean he's always worked but he works out of the house now so he's gone saturday through Wednesday um, so it's just Ellie and I at home with the dogs we also bought a home so <laughs> we'll have to share that with you um, lots of fun and exciting things that we need to fill you guys in on and share with you but I'm glad to be back um, feels weird for sure but hopefully lots of good things in store and I'm excited to have you guys along with us again definitely have missed you um, and missed that aspect of our life so anyways I'll see you soon. You can see yourself. <gasps> wow. Say hi. You're so pretty. <gasps> yeah, you are. <laughs> You're so pretty. Say hi. <gasps> oh, boy. You're so pretty. Yeah. Are you looking at the dogs? <gasps> hi. Can you say hi? Hi. <laughs> You're so beautiful. Do you know it? I guess I need to get hi. You seeing your beautiful self? Say hi. Hi. Oh, you're so pretty.